let's take a tour of Link360. When we log in, we end up on the home screen. Here you'll find real-time information about your lockout program. You can see recently viewed procedures also and information from Brady on updates. Click the view charts button to see your dashboards. You can see here that we have graphs on work that you've done so far in your program and work that's coming up as well. Let's take a look at the Find Create Files tab. Here you'll find your sites, your areas, and your equipment. You can select a piece of equipment to see any procedures, assessments, or attachments you've created or uploaded. Some users will have set up an admin tab. Here we'll add users to your site, set up their permissions, and build out our sites, areas, and equipment. Uh, you can see your subscription status in here as well. Under Lockout Tagout, we access our lockout procedures. I can write a new procedure, see what's been routed to me for approval, or what's out for review. Uh, I can also make changes to my templates if I need to. Like all modules, I can run reports on my lockout program as well. Now let's take a look at confined space. Here, I can write assessments for my confined spaces, identifying what hazards one would encounter if they were to enter. Once I finish an assessment, I can go through and write a permit form template if necessary. Users can also use this tab to request a permit for entry. They'll use the form that you created on that specific page. Again, we are able to edit templates in here and run reports. Finally, reliability. Uh, I can use this tab to create SOP procedures that include specific directions, photos and intervals on preventative maintenance tasks or regular work. And again, I can change templates, run reports here as well.